What's going on, everybody? It's voice actor Bobby G, and uh, guess what? I got a good microphone again. Yes, sir. <laughs> but uh, yes, we're about to uh, do the impressions video that I've been promising for a while. So here you go, guys. My brand new voice impressions video. Enjoy. <laughs> Yes, crystals. <laughs> Crystal heart. My crystal slaves. That is mine. What? No. No. Stop. Crystal Heart now in my possession. There is nothing to stop me from ruling the Crystal Empire. Kneel before Sombra. Ah, long live the king. Ha, you're no match for me. I will finally rule the Crystal Empire. Wait, with you out of the way, I will rule all of the Questria. Oh, yes. And I think I know exactly where I'll start. Your sweet little hometown. Or what? Without your elements, it will be so easy to control you. But there's no point. My conquering Ponyville is already your greatest fear. <laughs> is he friend or is he foe? Ooh, the Pony Wonders. I can assure you, I am no friend. I am Lord Tira. And I will take what should have been mine long ago. It appears we are at an impasse. How about a trade, Princess Twilight? Their release for all the Alicorn magic in Equestria. What's it going to be, Princess? Enough! I want an answer, and I want it now! And Grogar's long absence has given me time to prepare the next part of our plan. Grogar's bell. This artifact can steal any creature's magic. It holds that magic until it is released by this spell. Which means all the power inside is ours for the taking. <laughs> Magic season with age. Delicious. Oh, run along. The big stallions are playing. The perfect dessert to a legendary meal. Well, well, well. Some pony broke the no wings, no magic rule. Game's over, my little ponies. You didn't find your precious elements. Looks like we might be due for a big old storm of chaos. <laughs> oh, wait, did you? <coughs> How funny. You thought the elements were in the labyrinth? I never said they were in the labyrinth. Keep trying, Twilight Sparkle. Maybe the magic of friendship can help you. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some chaos to wreak. 
T-Rex tricked me into believing that he could offer me something more valuable than friendship. But there is nothing worth more. I see that now. He lied when he said that this medallion was given as a sign of gratitude and loyalty. But when I say that it is a sign of our true friendship, I am telling the truth. Grogar! I have been away too long if my name no longer strikes fear into the heart of one so tiny. Perhaps a demonstration of power is in order? Such confidence. Go, try to take back your kingdom. I shall send you there myself. If you prevail, you may keep it. But when you fail, you will submit to me. I'm leaving, since it's impossible to accomplish the work I need to do here. I suggest the three of you come to some kind of accord. I don't care how, but you all must learn to work together. Only then can we accomplish what you so greatly desire. The defeat of Twilight Sparkle and her friends. Ooh, fascinating. What can you really do? Bidding's good. I like bidding. Um, what are you supposed to be? <laughs> oh, how nice. Why is this one still moving? Yeah. So, speaking of problems, this place, it seems a little too... Oh, I don't know. Cute! I don't like cute. Never did like cute. Doesn't really go with my whole big, bad, powerful magic guy thing, doesn't it? Deliver the punchline, Tempest, because this has got to be a joke! Let's get this storm started! Ooh, hey, that's good. I should trademark that. Not bad. Actually, kind of first rate. What else does it do? Da -da 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 -da. Okay, hang on. <gasps> you gotta be kidding me! I can move the sun? <laughs> wow! Now this is what I'm talking about. <laughs> Time to play. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Day, night, day, night. Day, night, day, night, day, night, sunrise, sunset, bum, bum, ba, da, ba, da, bum, 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 I'm such a crazy villain, yes I am. Ponies of Equestria, we come on behalf of the fearsome, the powerful, the almighty, Storm King. And now, to deliver the evil, evil message, put your hooves together for Commander Tempest! Oh, I love pie. Sorry, bad spell service. You want me to call him back? Well, uh, funny story. It kind of seemed like she, she might have, you know, got away. A little bit. I know you're disappointed, but I got one word for you. Sponge cake. Well, if it isn't our little pony friend, Spike. That's nothing. When I'm in charge, the first thing I'll do is get revenge on those puny ponies. They'll regret they ever crossed Garble. We'll take whatever we want from Equestria and burn the rest. Ha! Get this, guys. Spike's pen pals with a nabby pammy pony princess. Iron Will's my name, Training Ponies is my game! But I pity the fool who doubts Iron Will's message! You don't doubt me, do you? Well that, my friends, is your first lesson. Don't be shy, look him in the eye! When some pony tries to block, show them that you're wrong! Yeah! Twily, you made it! A threat has been made against Canterlot. We don't know who is responsible for it, but Princess Celestia asked that I help provide additional protection. The burden of keeping Canterlot safe and secure rests squarely on my shoulders. You're my little sister. Of course you're important to me. But I would understand if you don't want to be my best mayor now. Let's just say the Empire isn't the only thing that's returned. Yup. Nope. Yup. Ugh! Yeah!
and by capturing the wholesale market, purchasing in bulk, and slashing all prices, we undermine every other gift market in town. And that's how Rich's Barnyard Bargains became the cornerstone of retail in Ponyville. Trixie truly is the most talented, the most magical, the most awesome unicorn in Ponyville. No, in all of Equestria. Here's an oat smoothie you asked for with extra hay, just how you like it. Tell us another story, great and powerful Trixie. Yeah, tell us how you vanquished the Ursa Major. Oh, of course, great and powerful Trixie. Anything you say, we are at your beck and call. It ain't gonna rise to greet y'all. Awfully rude, I reckon, but as you can see, I'm a fresh casualty of an unusual, unfortunate circumstance. A lot in life, I suppose. Wouldn't you know it, my lucky day. Just my luck. I was hoping you'd say no. I happen to be the premier party planner in all of Equestria. If there's a party in need, there I'll be. Be it Wingtown, Hoedown, Hootenanny, or Shindig, I'm your pony. Oh, I don't think so. I know so! Come on, ponies! Who here likes to party? No pony calls me boneless. Right, boneless? I was ready before I was born. Another town, another party. S Starlight! <laughs> My goodness, it's, it's been a long time. So, the Princess of Friendship want you and I to be friends again? Reading about magic is one thing, but you don't know what it's like at magic school to know much and not be able to do any of it. Solving a thousand-year-old mystery could take forever. Think of the research, the rereading, the re re reading This is not so, for I, Gustave Leglanc, to challenge your crew cake to a duel of delectable delicacies against my exceptionally exquisite incredibles. This will undoubtedly strike down all the competition, winning first prize and crowning me the champion. I am so sorry, Mulia, but Picky made your moose moose sound too like magnifique. Oh, what a world! What a world! Well, I was just sitting here, minding my own business, when this tacky little cloud of purple smoke just whisked past me and tore half of my beloved moustache clean off. And now, I look simply horrid. Oh, ho, 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 ho. It's true, I'm hideous. Clear the way, stand back, keep your hoops and tails to yourselves. Oh, my shining star, thanks to your sparkling costumes, dazzling choreography, and brilliant vocal effects that I designed, your performance was spectacular, countless Calamatora. Yes, gems, gems, oh, precious gems. He is the gem hunter. With him, we can have all those gems and more. Let's get the dragon. No, you're our precious little pony. Forever. <laughs> gems. Yes, the gems, the jewels. Find them, find them all. Don't worry, every pony. There are plenty of apples in Equestria. We'll find some others and make more cider than all a pony there can drink. With our machine, we can make enough cider in one hour to satisfy this entire town. My guests may be looking for nice music and parties, but working hard and making friends is how I turn this hotel into what it is today, and I plan to make it even bigger. <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> hey there, young dragons. <laughs> Name Sludge. How are your tails shaking? Uh, 
I saw an opportunity and I took it. That's what dragons do. Spike, my boy, with you by my side, I feel like we can do anything. Many thanks, Daddy Do. As you probably surmised, our earlier search for this treasure was unsuccessful. So kind of you to find it for us. That's Dr. Caballeron to you. <laughs> Daddy Do, my old nemesis, you may have smelted my jungle cats, but you cannot escape me! <laughs> oh, Daddy Do, I will so miss your amusing laughter jokes. Now, I must leave to commence the ring placing ceremony to at least 800 years of unrelenting, sweltering heat. <laughs> You summon me at your peril, Star Swell. Once I defeat all of you, this realm will embrace the darkness, as I did so long ago. Drawing me here will only make me stronger. You will never defeat me. I was once, until my friends betrayed me. I, I want to believe you. But the darkness will not be stopped! Princess Twilight Spark, I am Chancellor Nese. The questioner owes you a great debt, but Princess or no, we expect you to do things by the book. These aren't, not anymore. With the questioner under attack, ponies must stand together. Twilight has endangered us all by skipping off on friendship trips while these dangerous creatures run loose. <laughs>